The great Muslim scholar Ibn Rushd was born in Cordoba in Muslim Spain in 1126 AD. He was not only a great scholar but also a brilliant philosopher, geographer, mathematician. He also studied law and was appointed as a Razi. Ibn Rushd was the defender of Aristotelian philosophy. He wrote many articles on Aristotle and his philosophy. That's why he was given the title the commentator. His writing was appreciated by European thinkers and used for Renaissance in Europe in 13th century. Ibn Battuta Abu Abdullah Muhammad was commonly known as Ibn Battuta. He is considered as the most famous early Muslim travel. ERS. He was not only a famous tourist but also a great scholar, a well-versed lawyer, and a brilliant geographer. Ibn Battuta was born in Morocco in 1304 in a strict religious family. At the age of 21, he started Ed his first journey from Morocco to Mecca for performing Hajj. Then he traveled Eld from Spain to China and Central Africa to Russia. He also went to India where he met Muhammad Taflag who appointed him as the Thazi or After judge in his court. He disappeared from the pages of history till his death. He died in 1368 in Morocco. Al-Biruni, the great scholar, scientist, geographer, historian Abu Rayyan Al-Biruni, was born in Uzbekistan in 973 AD. He spoke Turkish, Sanskrit, Persian, Hebrew, and Syriac, but he always wrote in Arabic. It is said that he was the author of 113 books on various subjects. He was the first one who discovered the fact that the earth is rotating on its axis. He is considered the founder of Father Ophel Bairani in Dology because he visited India in 1030 and wrote one of his famous book, Kitabul Hind, in which he discussed culture, history, science, art and other things. He also said that the Sindh Valley was once just a ball of water or a basin of the sea. Some of his others. Books are Chronology of Theb Ancient Nations, Canon Astrolabe, and Kitab ul Tafim. Al Bairani died in Guinea, Afghanistan in 1058 D. Ibn Sina. Ibn Sina was born in a noble family of Bukhara in 980. He had a Persian origin and widely travelled Persia. Elbian Sina is known as the father of modern medicine because of his significant work in the field of medicine. The two of the famous books of Ibn Sina are Book of Healing which was an encyclopedia of philosophy and scientific research. Another was Canons of Medicines and Different Diseases. It is said that he wrote 450 books and articles on various subjects but only 240 survived. He died in Hamadan in 1037 AD. Ibn Khaldun, the father of modern historiography and sociology. Ibn Khaldun, an Arab Muslim, was born in Tunisia in 1332. He belonged to a well-known noble and educated family of Muslim Spain but later migrated to Tunisia. He was appointed as a Grand Azi in Cairo. He wrote many books but got fame for major pieces, like Kitab ul LBR, in which he wrote a preface called Mugaddama. He died in Egypt in 1406 AD. Omar al Khayyam Omar al Khayyam was born in Iran, then a Seljuk capital, in Khorasan in 1048 AD. He was a notable poet during the reign of the Seljuks and got fame for a new style of poetry Rubayat or Quatrains. Four-line stanza Khayyam's important contribution to mathematics and astronomy however is less known. 
he was not only a poet and astronomer but he was also a great philosopher omar khayyam also created important work on geometry specifically on the theory of proportion